Well, hello everybody. Look at this, I'm actually streaming on a Tuesday like I'm supposed to. It's a miracle, it's like Christmas or something. I'm Twinkle, or Eric, or Chezzy, or a whole bunch of names. I'm lots of names, I'm all the names, every name is me. Because I'm the important one that you should be watching stream right now. Which I hope you are, because if you're not, you, you, you can't hear me, so, I don't know. Oh, I could say a whole bunch of things right now, and if you're not watching me, you wouldn't know what I'm saying. Alright, this is a stream exclusive. If you're not watching, you won't hear me say this. I got a black fan in, in, my, in my room. See? Fact. Twinkle fact that you wouldn't know if you weren't watching the stream. Or watching it on YouTube later. But who am I kidding? No one watches my YouTube videos. So, hi! I'm here on Tuesday. Uh, it's Tuesdays with Twinkle. And we're going to be playing two games. Because what I was originally doing before I fell off of my regular schedule. Hopefully we're back to the regular schedule now. Alright, so, uh, we're starting off with some Undertale. As you can see right now. Right in front of your eyes right there. Unless you're not here, then you can't see it. But if you're here, you, you, you're seeing it. It's right, it's right here. And then after that, we're going to play some more Cuphead, because I want to play more of it. That, that's a good reason to stream things, in my opinion. Wanting to stream them. So! Let's hit that continue button, shall we? Last time, we left off right out here. We're in the core. We're on our way up through the core. Uh, being guided around by Dr. Alphys and being uh, hounded by Metaton at every turn. But right now, let's check out this place. There's a, there's a lot of webs. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, wait. I don't have to hold on because I could go to my box right here. I gotta get... Uh, we'll, put, we'll put the tutu away. I gotta get a my spider donut because I'm gonna... I'm gonna cheese this battle right here. <laughs> Did you hear what they just said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I heard that they love to stomp on them. It's not true. I, I usually let the spider go if I can. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. That's definitely not true, man. I'm not touching a spider to tear their legs off. Not true. The game got me all wrong. I heard... That they're awfully stingy with their money. <laughs> you think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, dearie? <laughs> I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what this next batch needs. Now this is normally, this is normally a kind of tough battle. In fact, let me do just like one or two rounds of it. Oh, what? I didn't fight? What, what I'm thinking? Let's just do one or two rounds of this fight. Let's just show you what's going on here. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Uh-oh, purple! Purple! See? If she traps you on this web, I think purple is a better look for you. <laughs> So we'll do one little, show you what this battle's all about. Why so pale? You should be proud. You have to send all these things at you and you only got three planes to move around on, so. Now, I could do the whole battle right here. Or, since I bought the spider donut back in the ruins, I could use it when this happens. Huh? Where did you get that? Did you steal it? Oh, my pet, it's time to show them what we do with these. Oh, what's this? Huh? A telegram for the spiders in the ruins? What? They're saying that they saw you and you helped donate to their cause. Oh, my, this has all been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that soul, they must have meant a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. <laughs> I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime and for no charge at all. 
I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. Yep, so if you bought a spider donut or a spider cider over in uh, the ruins and held onto it all this time and uh, ate it in front of her, you don't, have, you don't have to do any of the fight. You can just keep going. <laughs> that was fun. See you again, dearie. It's a tough fight. But didn't have to do any of it. Hillary, you're walking on my comics again. That means you'll have to leave. Oh, that human! Could it be? My one true love, Ellen Cleghorn. I'm sorry, I, 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 he's Don Pardo to me now. And here comes the uh, Final Fantasy VI homage. Final Fantasy VI is my favorite game ever. If I could stream that for you guys, I would love to. Although, that would be a lot of episodes. Oh, my love! Please run away! He's a good singer. Monster King! It forbids your stay! Humans must! Live far apart! Even if... It breaks my heart! He's a special guest musician for this episode. They'll put you in the dungeon. We can't get out there. It'll suck. And then you'll die a lot. Really sad. You're gonna die. Cry, cry, cry. So sad it's happening with special musical guest Metaton. So sad, so sad that you are going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. Oh no. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love has been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish! Oh, it's the color puzzle! Oh, heavens have mercy! The co horrible colored tile maze! Each colored tile has its own sadistic function! For example, a green tile sounds a noise, and then you must fight a monster! Red tiles will... Actually, wait a second! Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? I always meant to go back and count how many rooms back that was, just to see if it was really a hundred rooms. I should check out a map sometime and check that out. That's right! You remember all the rules, don't you? Great! Then I won't waste your time repeating them. I like this little purple fire. Oh, and you'd better hurry, because if you don't get through in 30 seconds... Uh-oh. You'll be incinerated by these jets of fire! Ha 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 ha! My poor love, I'm so filled with grief I can't stop laughing! Good luck, darling! Let's do this! Let's do it, everyone! We got this! It's there's gonna be no problem. We so oh we're through this oh it's getting through. Can't go that way. Okay, let's try this way. Okay, no, 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 I guess not. Okay, I think we're stuck. I think we're stuck. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> that's the that's the least I've moved at all in this puzzle before. It's allegedly supposed to be doable. But I sure wasn't able to do a bullet. Oh, I'm so sorry. Looks like you're out of time. Uh-oh. Here come the flames, darling. They're closing in. 
getting closer. Oh my! Any minute now. <clears throat> Watch out, I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. It's a good pun. It's a fireball. I said, watch out, I'll save you, and my kitty meowed. I'll save you too, Hillary, if you're trapped in a firewall. I will help. Oh no, how could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys. The... That's right. C come on, Metaton, give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now, now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling, what are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound, then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster... Is me! Oh no, Metaton, he's attacking me. I gotta yell. Yell, but nothing happens. This is it, darling! Say goodbye! That's oh, a phone. Your phone. Is that your phone? You'd better answer it. Hey, th this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. How, how, fourth wall breaking. The phone is resonating with Metaton's presence. Oh, that's yellow glow. Check this out. Oh man, yellow time. Boom, now press X. Boom, Metaton, boom. Oh man, ruined. Ooh. Ooh! You've defeated me! How can this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. I missed what he said there. <laughs> Lo looks like you beat him. You did a really good job out there. And I'll say all thanks to you. Wh what? Uh, oh, oh no, I, I mean, you were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Awkward. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but can I tell you something? B before I met you, I, I didn't really... I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like I couldn't do anything without... without ending up letting everyone down. B but guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So thanks for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, uh, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. Yeah, getting close to the end game, guys. My voice went all nuts there for a moment. Hey, it's this ice cream, man. Ice cream. An ice cream. Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellas bought all my ice cream. I've actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? That's so nice of you. It's our friend. Did you remember his name? Hey, hey! Did you remember my name? Did you? I did. What? You remember? How could I be so easily defeated? I'll always remember that you remembered. Yeah. <laughs> I like him. I'm a big fan of uh, Pete's Flamesman. Hot Spires guy. Hillary, no playing with that wire. That's a bad idea. Alright. 
Hey, it's our buddy Sands. Hey, I heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? I'll say yeah. I, I always got time for Sands. <laughs> Great, thanks for treating me. Over here, I know a shortcut. He knows a lot of shortcuts. He's crazy like that. Sorry, one second. Well, here we are. So, the journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, buddo. I like the phrase, buddo. It's like a mix of bud and kiddo. Sans, Sans, he's his own skeleton. He doesn't follow traditional, uh, traditional rules of, uh, friendly names. Buddo is fine by him. Though... Maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? That's a good thing to think about. Ah, uh, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Hey, let me tell you a story. Well, I'm a century in Snowden Forest, right? You sit out there and watch for humans? It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. It's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock-knock. And suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So, naturally, I respond, Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes is a very bad joke. Got him. I wish they would have done the, 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 but I'm right there. Oh, wow. Don't want to break the moment. Then she just howls with laughter. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So, I keep them coming, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock! I say, who's there? Old lady! Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel! <laughs> wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Pyrus gets kind of cranky with that bedtime story. But she told me to come by again, and so I did. Then I did it again, and again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door? It rules. Stare pensively at the, at the ficus. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name. But, someone who sincerely likes bad jokes, just has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy? You'd be dead where you stand. Oh boy. You don't mess with Sans. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I miss Bud out. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. That's right, isn't it? Well, chalk it up to my great skills. <laughs> He's right. I haven't died a single time. I'm too good at this game. Go me! Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you.
And then he leaves through this wall, apparently. Oh man, I hope you guys caught on to who he was talking about. Some kind of TV show featuring Metaton. It's a performance schedule. Comedians, dancers, sans. Seems there's a break now. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to the family. <laughs> That's not funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away. I haven't seen him since. I'm a terrible father. <laughs> That's not funny. Aw, oh, poor, poor Snowdrake's dad. Snowdrake was a monster we saw really early on in the game. He was the funny one who looked just like that guy. It's all, it all ties together. Let's give this a save. Um, hmm. Let's see. Uh, we could switch the uh, the burns pan out. Um. Hmm. That's all right now. Let's uh, head up here. Hey, check it out. Yeah, check it out. This is Braddy and Caddy. Oh, we have enough for the mystery key. Probably to someone's house, lol. Let's buy it. Braddy, we're gonna be rich. Yeah. Uh, let's talk. Uh, do we want to talk to them? We'll talk to them in a minute. There's someone else we need to talk to before we talk to Braddy and Caddy. It's very important. We gotta talk to this guy. Welcome to MTT Brand Burger Emporium, home of the Glam Burger. Sparkle up your day, trademark. Um, hmm. Oh, we can afford... Can we afford... Yeah, we got enough for the steak in the shape of Metaton's face. Sweet. Thanksy, have a fabulous day. Now we gotta talk to him. The customer is always right. What? Why do you keep trying to talk to me? I'll get in trouble if I get chummy with the customers. Sorry. So, I wanted to be an actor. I like this guy. I'm getting on in years, so let me give you some advice, little buddy. You still got time. Don't live like me. I'm 19 years old and I've already wasted my entire life. <laughs> it's one of my favorite characters in the game. Listen. I like you, little buddy, so I'm going to save you a whole lot of trouble. Never interact with inter attractive people! Unless you're one of them, they're just going to take advantage of you. Like that time those two chicks asked me to sneak them some flat hamburgers. And I, naive teenager that I was, said yes to them. Bad idea. We gotta hear more about that. So, I went out to the alley to see these two ladies and, uh, you know, see what would happen next. Then my boss, uh, saw me and asked me what I was doing. I was so startled, the hamburgers in my pockets tumbled down onto the ground. Not wanting to lose face, I scrambled to pick them up. But, as I was leaning over, the weight of the remaining hamburgers caused my pants to fall down. And the girls laughed at me. Everyone calls me Burger Pants now. Good old Burger Pants. When I first came to Hotlands, it was my dream to work with Metaton. Well, be careful what you wish for, little buddy! <laughs> why, is, why is he bad? God, have you even looked around? This place is like a labyrinth of bad choices! And every time we try to change something for the better, he vetoes it and says, That's not how they do it on the surface! Oh, right. Humans are always eating hamburgers made of sequins and glue. Why else is he bad? Why do people find him so attractive? 
He's literally just a freaking rectangle! You know, one time I bought one of those, uh, kits online to, uh, make yourself more rectangular. They don't work. <laughs> future? What future? Nothing down here ever changes! I'll probably be trapped in this stupid job forever. But wait! There's one thing that keeps me going! If Asgore gets just one more soul, we'll finally get to go to the surface! It'll be a brand new world! There's gotta be a second chance out there for me! For everyone! So stay strong, little buddy. When I make it big, I'll keep you in mind. <laughs> Freaking love burger pants. Anytime, little buddy. Alright, so now that we talk to him, let's get the other side of the story real quick. Ratty and Caddy. Let's ask him about burger pants. Oh, that guy from the store? Yuck. What a creep. Yeah, he's a creep. But he's kind of cute, huh, too. Come on, Caddy. Don't you have any standards? Nope. Okay, like, the annoying thing is, he just, he'd be okay if he just treated us with some respect. But he just acts really weird. And it acts like it's our fault that he acts that way. Like, when we asked him to get those glam burgers, he dropped them and ran away before we could even say anything. We were, like, going to share them. Really? I wasn't. Caddy! Alright, so we heard their side. So let's let him know that. Let's let him know some stuff like that. Talk back to Burger Pants again in this silly little side quest that there's no reason for me to be doing it. Except for fun. The girls were talking about me? They say I should stop acting like they owe me? And if I wanted to be friends with them, I should just, uh, try to see things from their perspective? Wow. Poor naive little buddy. They've brainwashed you. Friendship is just a hot person's way of making you their slave. So, uh, what time would they want to hang out? Aw. Poor Burger Pants. You're so miss... You're so... I think there's more to say to them, I forget. Yes, we know. The elevators of the city is not working. Because of this incident, rooms are running at a special rate. 200 g a room. Interested? Oh, I don't have enough money. I meant to check out what happens there. I've never gone and tried to stay at the hotel. Oh, we'll, we'll earn some more money as we go through that part. Oh, uh, yeah, he should come look for junk with us. But, like, if we let him hang out with us, I just worry it'll be really super fun. Um, that was not what I was going to say. But I was close, right? Well, that kind of guy... You hang out with him once, then he wants to hang out all the time. But don't you feel bad for him, Brady? Poor Burger Pants. Think about how cool we are compared to him. We'd be saving his life with our friendship. His life, Brady! Uh, so? Think of all the glam burgers he could get for us. So is he free after work? Aw, oh, man, was... I don't know whose side I'm on with this. Burger Pants is clearly, uh, not, you know, clearly in the wrong, but they're kind of materialistic. They want to hang out after work? Ha! <laughs> yes! I won't let you down! <laughs> Little buddy, thank you. You brought a tear to the eye of this old man. So, uh, where do they want to go? They want to hang out at the garbage dump. Well, nowhere to go but up, right, little buddy? Now, is there something else to say to them? Look at all this progress I'm not making in the story. It's alright. You don't always have to be uh, progressing in the story. We can set up a nice little hangout with these two. Oh, that's all you can say. Alright. We're setting, uh, setting these two up for a nice little friendship hangout. 
Now before we go there, let's real quick check out that key. Because I know exactly where that mystery key I bought goes. Doing all the side stuff for, for funsies. I accidentally had enough money for the key. <laughs> I should... Uh, I'll go see what happens at the hotel later. Because I've never stayed at the hotel. Let's go over to Waterfall. Like, every... I've said to people a million times, every time I play this... I end up seeing, or I see someone play this, I end up seeing something I didn't see before. It's weird, because I thought, you know, every time I think I've done, like, everything there is to do in the game. But I keep being proved wrong. <laughs> like, I've done most of the, like, big things, but every once in a while there's just a little something I haven't seen. Let's use that mystery key right here. Use the mystery key. The red house's door was unlocked. The key disappeared. All right, there's a whole bunch of journals in here. Dear diary, Shiren's sister fell down recently. It's sad. Without her sister to speak for her, she's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her, and Bluki and I should all perform together sometime. She seemed to like that idea. Dearer diary, I'd like to buy a new diary for every entry I make. I love to collect diaries. <laughs> this is one way to do it. Dearest diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. That leaves just Bluki and I. Bluki asked me if I was going to try to become corporeal too. They sounded so resigned. Come on, Bluki, you know I'd never leave you behind. And besides, I'd never find the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. My darling diary, I met someone interesting today. Last week I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Honestly, she's a dork, and she's obsessed with these awful cartoons. But she's kind of funny too. I want to see her again. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. Yeah, that is the fifth one. Dear Diary, she surprised me with something today. Sketches of a body that she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I, I can finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I could be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Baluki. My dreams can't wait for anyone. And that's all there is to that. I hope you guys figured out who they were talking about there. It's kind of... I think it's kind of obvious, but then again, I know. So it might not be quite as obvious. It might just be the fact that I am aware of who they're talking about. I don't know. It's Metaton. <laughs> I, uh... I almost did the voice for Metaton there. But I decided let's just uh, do it in a normal voice there. And let you guys draw your own uh, conclusions to it. But then I just decided to say who it was anyway. So what the hell was the point? What's inside an acorn? It's really just a mystery. I've always wondered that. All the time. River person, you, uh, you resonate with me. All right. Let's, uh, let's, uh, get on with actual plot. I mean, like, the, the actual story progression. That was plot. That was, like, extra little bits that you could, uh, find out about. Hi, he's Flames guy. He's Flames man. I remembered his name. All right. Let's keep this train going. Let's save... 
Once I get enough money, I'm gonna go and, uh, check out what that hotel does, even if it's, like, wasting my time. I don't care. Huh? H who are they? N nobody else is supposed to be here. Uh, oh, well. We can't worry about that now. I'm gonna try and find the fastest way through the core. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. The elevator isn't working. What? The, the elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. I never actually read what she said here. Alright, now just keep heading up. That, that pit isn't on my map. Forget it! Let, let's try the left side! Alright, let's try the left side. Okay, you should be able to make it through here. Watch out! See, at this point, I originally, the first time I played this, I went straight left, because I didn't trust her. <laughs> Alright, let's take care of magic here. Magic interrupts you by chattering to itself. It gibberish dizzies you. Your defense drops by one. Alakazam! Wait, I thought that was the solution. I don't remember ever being dizzy by that. Oh, I guess... That's weird. I don't remember that ever happening. That was close. Why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? We've just got to keep heading forward. I really don't remember that ever doing that. I'm pretty sure I always talk to him. And obviously it works, but I don't remember ever having my controls reversed like that. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch. But, but these lasers will activate when you do. Um, looks like they'll uh, come in disorder. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move until the third one. She was wrong. She was so wrong. Oh my god, what, are you hurt? I, I, I'm so sorry, I, I gave you the wrong order. Everything's gonna be fine, okay? Well, let's just keep heading to the right. All right. Uh, crossroads, uh, uh, tr try heading to the right. I headed up. <laughs> Night night blocks away. Oh, I'm low on health. Adieu. Damn. All right, let's uh, let's sing to Night Night. He sings Shiren's song. All right, I did learn Shiren's song, so I. Oh wait, no, I still would have had to dodge this time. Okay. If you, uh, if when you encounter Shiren, you, uh, do the whole thing I did and hum until she's done, this, it takes only two, uh, singing to, um, finish this fight. Otherwise, it takes three. The random things I know about this game. Are you okay? Why didn't you head to the right? Come on, you trust me, don't you? plans do I have? I still have to go back and check out that hotel. <laughs> Priorities! Look, more lasers. Uh, okay, I, I won't mess around this time. I'll just deactivate the lasers and let you through. They're, they're not turning off. I can't turn them off. I, it's okay, I have this under control. I'm going to turn off the power for the whole node. Then you can walk across. Okay, go! Power's off. Nothing wrong could possibly happen here. Wait! Stop! Oh god. The, the power, it's turning itself back on! Damn it! This isn't supposed to... I, I... I'm gonna turn it off again. When it turns off, move a little, and then stop! Okay? You won't get hurt. 
It's like Red Rover. No, not Red Rover. Red like green light. See? I've got everything under control. Everything's under control. I think she's trying to convince herself when she's trying to convince me. Okay, you should... You should... Uh, uh, I don't know. This doesn't look like my map at all. I'm sorry. I... I... I have to go. Oh, man. It's alright, Alphys. I know where I'm going. Let's save. Let's go this way first. There's the ice that's coming all the way from Snowden. That's what it's for, to cool down the core. We're gonna go this way here. And we got a little puzzle we gotta do. Good old uh, sliding block puzzles. Oh wait, I had it. Oh, I had it. What did I do different that time? Oh, there we go. Yay! Now, easiest way is to go back down. But real quick, I'm gonna head up this way. And get me a glam burger from over here. Yeah! Cause I had inventory space. So now that I did that puzzle, go back this way. Save again just because we can. Head up that way. Head to the right. See? I cannot fight, I cannot think. But with patience, I will make my way through. That's not the sign I meant to re read. But there's a sign that says to the right. It tells you to go do the puzzle and then go this way. It's one of the ways you can go about this. Astigmatism, I always get mixed up. Sometimes you don't pick on them and it works. Sometimes you do pick on them and it works. I think it's based on um, what face it's showing you. But I could be absolutely wrong on that. We have enough? No, we don't have enough money to go check out the hotel. But I'm not going all the way. Oh, and that is the last trophy. And I have the platinum now. That I should have gotten ages ago. But I wasn't playing except for when I was streaming. It's a very easy platinum, this game. Alright. Um, I'm going to make sure I have all the food I need. Because this can be a tough battle. That's all the food I have. I, I don't think I'll need any more. Oh, yes! There you are, darling! It's time to have our little showdown! It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not! Malfunction? Reprogramming? Get real! This was all just a big show! An act! Alphys has been playing you for a fool the whole time! As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be a part of it. So she decided to insert, yourself into, insert herself into your story. That's the words I wanted. She reactivated puzzles. She disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you. All so she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. All so you would think she's the great person that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alphys is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so kindly, highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I have no desire to harm humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? <laughs> 
Uh oh. Hey, hey! W what's going on? The, the door just locked itself! Sorry, folks! The old program's been cancelled! But we've got a finale that will drive you wild! With Adam Sandler! Real drama, real action, real bloodshed! On our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot! And it's on attacks. This is probably what you'll do if things continue in this manner. Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core! I was the one that hired everyone to kill you! That, however, was a short-sighted plan. You know what would be a hundred times better. Killing you myself! Oh, man. That worthless pea shooter won't work on me, darling. Don't you understand what acting is? Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. No, you haven't. I'll fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul. And with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity! Oh. <laughs> Medicine. But if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan! I can save humanity from destruction! Nice and simple. Then, using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being! Hundreds! Thousands! No, millions of humans will watch me! Glitz! Glamour! It'll f I'll finally have it all! So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby! Oh. Uh, I can't see what's going on in there, but... Don't give up, okay? There's one last way to beat Metaton. It's, um... It's... This is a work in progress, so don't judge it too hard. But you know how Metaton always faces forward? Sure. That's because there's a switch on his backside. Thank you. So if you turn him around, um, and, um, press the, the, the switch, he'll be, um, he'll be vulnerable. Well, gotta go. Let's do that, man. Seems like a good time to turn Metaton around. I can't agree. I can't disagree. You tell Metaton that there's a mirror behind him. Oh, a mirror? Right, I have to look... Perfect for our grand finale! Uh, where's the switch? I can't find it. I don't see it! Where is it? Oh. Did you... just flip... my switch? Oh man. Oh man! Oh yes! See, it was close. It was close to the voice. Sort of. Oh, yes. Oh, my. If you flip my switch, that could only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. I'll do a slightly different voice now. He's not this is a different form. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments absolutely beautiful. It's Metaton time. Metaton EX makes his premiere. All right, so in this battle, you see that rating that's going down there? We want that rating to go up and up and up. Boasting, um, you don't get you get more ratings if you don't get hit. So I think I'm pretty decent at this fight. So let's uh, we're gonna be boasting a lot. I, I'm very practiced in this fight at this point. So hopefully, the boasting will work and we'll just, uh... We'll just keep going up and up and up in our ratings. Hopefully I won't mess up and get hit by anything. 
because if you do get hit, then the rating stops going up for that round. Doing, so, doing good so far. Oh no, I got hit. All right. Uh, one hit, no big deal. I I don't think I've ever gotten through without getting hit once. It's time for a pop quiz. Have fun with the on-screen keyboard. I wonder what this will look like on the screen. This one's an essay question. What do you like most about Metaton? We're gonna tell him legs. Well, the, oh, it just shows the keyboard. That's right, legs is the correct answer. All right, keep doing this. Keep getting those ratings up. Yes, I really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Damn. Oh, that was poor. I usually don't get hit this often. This often being twice. I say it as if like I'm getting destroyed here. Ooh, I'm just warming up. All right. Clear some of that out. Get around the ha the hearts. Looking pretty good. You say you aren't gonna get hit at all. I'm not. But how are you on the dance floor? So we got the blue beams here. Stay still for them. But then the white beams come around, so you gotta shoot the disco ball. Change them blue. The first time I played this, I had no idea about that. I was like, how the hell do I not get hit by this? Oh, that, that I didn't realize. Oh, that was, that was terrible. Lights, camera, bombs. There we go. There we go. Nice and easy dodge in there. Once you know what's going on there, it's pretty easy. And now the union regulated break. Happy break time. He is going nuts. You say you aren't gonna get hit at all! I sure won't, maybe, possibly. Oh, that's another heart to heart! Oh, that was close. Oh! We're good. Arms? Who needs arms with the legs like these? I'm still going to win! Oh right, that's a bad thing. Oh god, that was bad. Uh, please live. Okay. That was the worst I've ever done that part. Let's eat the face steak. The crowd loves it. That's why I bought that one. Nice little audience boost there. Yeah, the crowd reacts differently to you eating things. Like, if you eat junk food, the crowd um, boos and you lose ratings. But uh, you eat a steak in the shape of Metazon's face, or you eat a glam burger, and uh, you get better ratings. Okay, that was good. Lights, camera, enough of this. Do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? There we go. That should be it, I think. Witness the true power of humanity's star. Oh, I think this is it. That should be it. Wait, did something just hit me? Uh, it seemed like something hit me at, after that. Oh, look at these ratings! This is the most viewers I've ever had! We've reached the viewer call in Milestone! 
one lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? It's Loki. Oh, hi, Metaton. I really like watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement in my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh. No, wait, wait, look. They already hung up. I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made it so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll do watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton J toll in my Metaton J tart. Uh, I... I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I leave an aching void that can never be filled. So, I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Ascor. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is... inefficient. In a few moments I'll run out of battery power and... Well... I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. I I finished open the lock. Are you two? Oh my god. Metaton! Metaton, are you? Thank God, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would've... I would've... I, I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you messed it up, I could always... just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? I can't go this way yet. Sorry about that. Let's keep going. So, so you're you're about to meet Asgore, huh? Y you must be you must be pr pr pretty excited about all that, huh? Yo, f finally, you know, finally get to go home. Wait! I mean, um, I... I was just going to, um... Say goodbye, and... I, I can't take this anymore. I... I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul. And a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. 
Wait. Come back. This is a long hallway. Oh, this way is open now. Let's save real quick. You know what? I think this is a good time to uh, stop for tonight. Um, when I pick this up next, I'm going to go make some money and, and see what that hotel room does. Maybe I'll do that off camera because that's not important to the story. Although with, all, with how much I've talked about it now, it might be a disappointment if I leave that out. But, um, and then we've got the final stretch. So, thanks for watching. Stick around. We're going to be playing Cuphead in a few moments. I need to go upstairs and get me a drink. Um, it'll take a couple moments longer than my usual mid-game pause because I have to switch consoles. Um, but we will be back in just a couple of minutes with some Cuphead. I know I saved already, but I like to double check. So stick around, we'll be right back. <laughs> 